Well, good morning, everybody. Hope everybody is doing well. Uh, yeah, I'm over here at the uh, park again doing my laps. Uh, just wanted to let you know something came up and I uh, have postponed our trip until about February, about the end of February next year. Uh, there is a good reason. Something came up, and uh, it was an uh, it's an opportunity, and I took it. So uh, what I did was I actually bought some property over in Cebu. So, so uh, it was such a good deal; I couldn't pass it up. And the area was fantastic. My sister-in-law went over and scoped it all out. Made sure everything was was uh, in line and correct. So uh, it all looks good. I've sent the money. The money has been picked up. And the deal has been done. Now what I did was I paid half down and then when the papers are not in my name because I can't hold, I can't own Philippine uh, land, um, it will be in my, uh, my kids names since they are Philippine citizens. Uh, so uh, but yeah, I bought that. It is, uh, I'll let you know what it is. I'll, I'll put another video up pretty soon and show you. I'm hoping to get some, I've got some great photos of it and video, uh, but I'm hoping to get a lot more. Okay, what it consists of. Uh, it is in, uh, oh my, Dumanhug. It is in Dumanhug which is uh, a little bit north west of Argao, kind of over towards uh, Mualboal, which is a beautiful area. Uh, okay, it is, I'm sure you've heard this word before, it is overlooking. So yes, it sits up on top of a hill, not a big hill, I don't like I don't want to be on top of a mountain uh, so yeah it's it's a it's a hill but it's not something terrible there is a paved road out front uh, it is not super wide but you can you can uh, get a couple cars through there motorcycles yeah, no problem tricycles no problem a couple cars one going each way would be good and but that would probably be the max of it i mean if you get a big truck coming through there imagine the car is going to have to get over but uh the uh yeah the pavement looks to brand looks to be brand new all concrete uh okay what it consists of it is 2000 square meters overlooking lots of uh, coconut trees Lots of banana trees. Uh, there is at least one, possibly two, mango trees. And what else is there, I'm not sure. But that was the things that stood out the most. And if there are no papaya trees, when I get there, there will be. So, uh, yeah. That's why things got kind of got slowed down and postponed. Uh... My plan right now is to, when I get over there, I want to build a bamboo house on that property. Of course, it's all going to be fenced. Um, so, uh, but yeah, what I'm thinking is 
the uh, bottom half of the house is going to be hollow block and then the top half is going to be uh, bamboo and of course I want the metal roof I like the thatch roof but I can't it's not going to do what I want it to do so uh, I'm going to stop right here because I'll have the sun behind me if I don't uh, because it's not going to do what I want it to do what I want to do is some rainwater harvesting off the roof. My solar. I've already got a company lined up to get the solar. I'm going to do the install myself. I'm not exactly sure how big of a system right now, um, but I've got a pretty good idea of the ballpark I want. Anyways, uh, that's the quick update. I got a mower coming my way, so I think I'm going to turn around. <laughs> it's going to get noisy. Uh, that's the quick update. That's the reason for postponing uh, our trip until the end of February. So, uh, it is what it is. I'd like to get over there, but... Uh, I had to take advantage of this deal. This is it. This is what I've been looking for ever since I've gone to the Philippines. Uh, so uh, I had the chance. The deal was great. Of course, there's a lot of great deals out there right now because of the situation. Uh, people just selling off because they need the money. You know, I mean. I, I don't want to take advantage of people. I gave them what they were asking uh, because uh, you know there's a lot of people over there hurting right now. So they're they're doing what they can to stay afloat. So uh, I'm gonna turn around again. The mower is going away. Oh, it's coming back. Anyways, uh, but yeah, I got a great deal. It's some beautiful land over in Dumenhoog. So uh, that's it. Yeah. Gonna put a bamboo house on there and fence it all in. It'll probably be bamboo fencing. I don't want this big wrought iron concrete block fence that just looks. Yeah. I mean, they do the job, but you know what most people there are going to be respectful of your boundaries as long as you got some kind of fence they know you know hey that's somebody else's property don't go there so uh, there's a few that there's very few that might not respect it but uh, you know they'll be dealt with <laughs> okay anyways that's about it for now uh, looking at uh, late February so yeah it'll be good to get over there and stomp around on that have some bananas have some uh, have some mangoes the mangoes are great oh my gosh and <laughs> anyways that's it for now I've rambled on for long enough hope you enjoy this video and uh, I'll catch you later bye